back to my channel i hope you guys are doing well and today i'm back again with another makeup tutorial and this makeup tutorial is actually a fall makeup tutorial i think you guys can already tell because of the lip color because it's very bold so if you guys want to see how i did this look let's move on to the tutorial as always i'm going to be starting off with my base makeup and to prime my face i'm going to be using my all-time favorite smashbox pore minimizing primer smashbox primers are so amazing they actually came out with a new one that's the primerizer that's like a primer and a moisturizer at the same time and they also came up with a holiday set where they have two of these primers like the pore minimizing one and their original one which is like the white silicone one and also they do have like a travel size primer water so that's a really good deal and it's like like twenty dollars so i think i'm gonna get that one now i'm taking the illegal pro hd concealer in the shade fawn to color correct a little bit under my eyes and around my mouth and i have a few spots going on on them and um the beauty community has been like going crazy with so many new launches with holiday coming up there is like so many products coming out and just yesterday i saw that huda beauty is coming up with more eyeshadow palettes and they are like mini palettes so they're going to be really good for traveling i don't know which one i'm gonna get but i kind of like want them all but i already know that somehow i think i already own most of the shades and palettes that i own but who knows for foundation today i'm going to be using my lung content adult foundation and this is in the shade 415 bisque w Now I'm gonna use my Tarte Shade Tape Concealer and many of you have been asking me which shade I actually use. I've already like mentioned it thousand times in my videos that I use the shade medium but I think after I finish this one I'm gonna go a shade like down. I'm gonna I think I'm gonna get the tan one. Now to set my face and my under eye area, I'm going to be using my all time favorite Sasha Buttercup powder and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my damn beauty blender and I'm gonna like take the powder, apply it in the highlighted portions and then just dab it around my face and then I'm gonna later take a brush and then dust it off a little bit so that if any of the part is left alone, it also gets the powder. Now I'm gonna start off my eye makeup and at first I'm going to be taking the Huda Beauty Desert Dusk eyeshadow palette. As my transition color, I'm going to be picking up the shade Blazing with a blending brush. And now for my crease, I'm going to be taking the shade Saffron. And now from my Makeup Revolution Acid Brights palette, I'm going to be picking up this mustardy olive green type of shade with a flat shading brush and I am going to be applying this one in my eyelid at first damp and then I'm gonna press it on so that the color payoff is great.
Oh my god, do you see the packaging? It's so beautiful. This is the Dose of Colors Desi XKD Club eyeshadow palette and this is the girls palette the reason why actually i'm doing this tutorial is because i wanted to use these things so today i'm going to be picking up this eyeshadow from here this is in the shade harpoon and it's supposed to be used wet but i'm not gonna use it wet because i think the formula is pretty much like squishy already so i'm not gonna wet it and now i'm gonna just pick it up with my fingers and apply it in my eyelid Now from the Desert Dust palette, I'm going to be picking up the shade Oud and I'm going to be deepening my outer V with this one. To line my eyes, I'm going to be taking my Maybelline Master Ink Eyeliner. I'm lining my waterline with a black eye pencil. For my lower lash line, I'm taking the shade Oud and then we are going to be smudging it out with the shade Blazing. For highlighting my brow bone, I'm going to be using the shade Seuss from the Desi X Katie Dose of Color Eyeshadow Palette and my brush is wet because this is supposed to be used wet. I'm almost done with my eye makeup, so now I'm gonna just quickly apply some mascara and false eyelashes and then I'll be back. I'm so glad that I finally did use this one in front of camera and um, I love this collection. To be honest, I wouldn't have actually like bought this collection, like I actually didn't get much, I got three products from the collection, whole collection. But I'm really glad that I actually got them and uh, the reason behind like buying these products were I really love Desi Perkins and Katie and the bond they have like they are like more than sisters I think they're like more than family and I just love them so that's that's the thing that made me like buy this one but if it was I think someone else's collab then I don't think I would have like paid any heed to it but uh, I'm glad that I got it because I really like it. I didn't like the shade uh, the shade that I'm using right now, Harpoon. I didn't like it that much when I like first got the palette because you know it's like a dirty money type of color. Mm, the base is like a ashy base, but so you can see that to change that up, I have used like a greener shade underneath my eyeshadow. So it makes it pop a little bit more in my complexion. I think it will look like amazing in paler complexion, but in my complexion, it looks a little bit dull. This collection was limited edition and the last restock has been like already done. And I think it's still available in their website. So if you guys wanna get this one, then you can get it from Draws of Colors website. Or if you are from here, Bangladesh, then you can get it from Upsheen BD or Shop Online because I've seen that Shop Online does have this one too. But I bought this one from Afshin BD when the first uh, when the first launch was done. Actually, I ordered them from like Afshin BD. I pre-ordered my items, so it's been a while since I have them in my hand. So this is the palette, and I'm really glad that they actually made this one an actual limited edition collection because the word limited edition is just a joke right now because brands throw this word like in a collection and then say that it's limited edition but and then they're like it's coming back then they're like uh it's permanent so that's like a really no no 
as a consumer I really don't like it when they say that a collection is limited edition and then they make it permanent that really pisses me off so this is a limited edition one I also got the highlighter and the and one of the liquid lipsticks so you will see me applying those in a few minutes now I'm going to be bronzing up my face and for that I'm going to be using my W7 bronzer Now I'm going to be contouring my face with the Too Faced Chocolate Celine Bronzer. As this is a fall look, so I'm going to use a pumpkin spice type of color for my blush. And this is the sleek blush in the shade Sahara. And now from the Huda Beauty 3D Highlighter Palette, I'm going to be picking up the shade Fiji with my beauty blender and I'm gonna apply it in my cheekbones and then I'm gonna go in with the dose of color Desi X Kitty highlighter in the shade Fuego. And now I'm taking the highlighter in the shade Fuego. I bought the Fuego one because it's like more a golden -y type of highlight and there was another one that was Mirami and Mirami was actually a rose gold type of highlighter so I skipped on that one and I got Fuego and if you don't know what Fuego means Fuego means actually fire Okay, so you can use any color you want to pair up with this eye makeup look, but as I am going with the fall vibe, I want to like try out something very vampy, and I'm gonna use this Desi X Katie Dose of Colors liquid lipstick, and this is in the shade Savage. They also had another one, uh, that one was the Half Fire one, which is like a very curly neon orange type of shade. I skipped on getting that one because. I don't think that I'll be wearing that shade that much because it's like very neon. So I did line my lips beforehand so that I don't mess up. So this is the final look after finishing the rest of my makeup. I hope you guys all enjoyed this one and this was helpful for you guys. And if you guys like this video, please don't forget to give this one a thumbs up. And all the product lists will be given down in the description box below. Please don't forget to check that and out. And if you guys still haven't subscribed in my YouTube channel, then please do subscribe. And make sure to follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and also in Snapchat. And I will catch you guys again in my next video. Till then, you guys take care. Bye-bye.